Hey, Castleton Christian Church, I hope you had a chance to enjoy this beautiful Saturday we have been given. I'm looking forward to worshiping with you once again virtually online tomorrow, like we've been doing about the last eight to ten weeks. In the last few days, we have been given a bunch of numbers. Uh, May 4th, May 8th, uh, May 25th, June 4th, July 4th. As a guy who doesn't do math, it doesn't take a lot to be overrun with numbers. I say that because I want you to know this. We are going to do everything we can to communicate to you how we are moving forward as a church. What does that look like for us as a church body? We're going to use means like this. We're going to use email. We're going to use social media. We're going to use maybe phone calls and text messages. We're just going to try to get the word out as we continue to move forward as a church. As a leadership, we're praying that God would give us knowledge, wisdom, and discernment to seek his counsel of what he wants us to do for this local church body. We're praying for courage, and God would also make us cautious at the same time. I want you to know a couple things when it comes to us moving forward. Number one, for the next two weekends, that includes tomorrow and the following weekend, service will be exactly the way it has been. Okay, so for two weekends for sure, we know that service will be exactly the way it's been online, Facebook, and YouTube. As we move forward and look at what does that mean as we get closer together and come together once again as a church body, what are the things we got to think through, things we need to work through, I want you to hear this. I don't ever want you to be in a situation where you feel like you have to compromise your health. If you feel like it is unsafe for you to, to come to whatever form of gathering we're having as a church, you have my permission to stay home. The services will still be online. You can still watch on Facebook and YouTube. You'll still be able to do that. I don't ever want you to be in a situation where you feel like if you get out or even potentially be around people, it could compromise your health or the health of anybody else, okay? So as we look forward, we're asking God, God, what do you want us to do as a church body? Please hear this. What a church down the street does does not necessarily mean that we're doing that as well. What we do may not even be what any other church does. We're asking God, what do you want us to do when it comes to Castleton Christian Church? I want to invite you to join us in praying for that. God, would you go before us cloud by day, fire by night, make it incredibly obvious to us what you want us to do as a church. Once again, services will still be on Facebook and YouTube. Now, speaking of Facebook and YouTube, you probably don't even know this, but in the last number of weeks, I told Anthony, you monitor Facebook, any comments, anything that happens there, and I'm going to hang out on YouTube for those folks, you know, and be there in case they have a question and say, hey, what was that verse, or I like that song. I'll be there. I'm going to hang out there. But here's what's happening. It's me watching me talk to me, and I'm starting to get a complex. Uh, I want to invite you, if, if you're not a Facebooker, if, if maybe someone shared this video with you, and you're like, I don't even have a Facebook account, go over to YouTube, Caston Christian Church, uh, search that. That's where our sermons are at, video announcements, stuff like this. You can go there, and there's a section where you can leave comments and stuff. It'd be great if you just check on me once in a while, see how I was doing, see if I need anything. You know, no big deal, whatever. But, hey, appreciate you guys. Talk to you in a little bit.